We'll do a quick walk around of the 39 Packard Model 1701 Club Coupe. Show you the condition of the car. It's beautifully restored. Has a magnificent restoration down to fine details such as the correct color pinstriping. Tires are BF Goodrich Silvertown. It has the correct type of headlight lens, not updated with seal beams. The chrome has all been beautifully redone. All the rubber is new. The car has uh, been completely restored. It's painted the color it was when it was new. Packard maroon. The car was so new, sold new in uh, Norfolk, Virginia in 1939. And it's always been a southern car. It remained in Virginia until I bought it a couple of years ago. And uh, it's now in South Carolina. As far as I know, it never had any rust on it. The interior is just magnificent in this car. It's done in the correct original pattern and material. You open up the glove box and the light comes on as it did when it was new. Everything works on this car. The dash lights work, for example. A lot of Old cars, they seem to neglect little details like that. The steering wheel is just spectacular. It's the, uh, not the standard wheel, but the deluxe steering wheel. As a club coupe, it has jump seats in the back that fold up or down. So there's one uh, that's put down here and the other one is up. If you fold them both up, you have a lot of extra storage space. All the rubber is new. Everything was done on this car and done correctly. Notice the little details such as the fluted pattern on the door handle. Beautiful Art Deco details on the car. The door hardware has the same Art Deco pattern. It's just, just spectacular. And uh, this is NOS hardware that's on the car, new old stock. The carpet is dark brown. All the dash chrome has been redone. The headliner 
It is in beautiful condition. The sun visors. There's a switch. And you see the uh, interior light works. It has the 282 Packard straight eight that's been restored to show condition. It has not been updated to 12 volts. It's uh, six volt electrics and it starts right up. I've never figured out why people want to update 6 volt cars to 12. They started when they were new. People drove them every day. Why can't they start when they were stored? Well, this one does. So it doesn't need any updating of the ignition system. It's still on the original uh, points uh, system. No updating of that. One little detail that I don't know if the video will show or not is the uh, hood ornament, which probably won't show, but the edge of the glass has a greenish appearance, which is correct because the original had the Corning, Corning New York glass in it. A lot of reproductions nowadays uh, use some other glass that's clear on the edge, but this has the greenish tone on the glass. Now the next video we uh, do will be uh, taking the car for a drive.